Little bundle of joy. <laughs> Beth, right there with your what? job is. What my job is? Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I believe today is the 13th, it is a Monday. It's about 4.30 p.m. right now and I'm starting off this week's College Week in My Life video. This is my last like real College Week in My Life ever, which is so freaking crazy to think about. Like I have my entire high school and college career essentially just documented on here. Um, I was like thinking about it a lot last night and like how crazy that is. Um, sorry, the lighting. The lighting totally just changed because the sun went behind the house that faces my apartment. Um, but it is Monday, like I said this morning. I had work for a couple hours, then I went to Oak House. You guys know how it goes. I had one class, um, but I didn't stay for that long. It was only like 30 minutes that we were there. And now I'm home. I have a dinner for all of the senior members of the office that I work for. I showed some clips of it this morning. I work at our professional development office. I don't think I've ever said that in a video. I've said like I have an on-campus job, um, but I've never said like which one just for like security reasons. But by the time this goes up, um, I'll have finished my last shift there, which is so weird, so spooky. Everything is spooky right now. So like I said, we have our senior send-off dinner tonight, so I'm about to get ready for that. It starts at 5.30. I'm not sure what I'm gonna wear. My hair is super greasy, so I need to figure that out, and I wanna clean up my room a little bit. I am drinking some coffee at home, which is really off-brand for me. I am such an advocate for going and buying coffee and not making it at home, which is like a hot take, and I understand that. Um, but if you saw my last college week in my life, my mom and dad sent me a care package and it had a like little bottle of coffee in it and I tried it today and it's actually really good. I used my roommate's like French vanilla almond milk creamer, which I think helped a lot too, but I really like it. So recommend. So that's the plan for tonight. I think after the dinner, um, all the seniors are going to go get a drink at Oak House because they're like half coffee shop, half bar if you're new here. Um, also, if you're new here, I'm a senior at Elon, obviously. I feel like that was clear from the title, but if not, that's what's happening. So I'm going to I'm gonna clean up my room for a bit, I think, and then I'll start getting ready and check in when I have an outfit and all that to show you guys. I just finished tidying up my room. I want to do a quick overview of what this space looks like. It honestly really does not look any different than the last like three room slash apartment tours on this channel because not a lot has changed but I feel like I have every other space documented so I just want to do a quick like overview and I'll highlight anything I have that's new um, but if you want to know like where things are from I'll link previous apartment and dorm tours below because I really have not gotten anything new that's significant in the last like year and a half or so so here is the quickest of all room tours of my senior spring in college if you've been watching my channel for a while, you're probably familiar with the apartment complex I've lived in the last year and a half, but basically there's two sides to it. One side has two bedrooms, one side has one bedroom. The last two semesters I lived on a two bedroom side. This semester I live on a one bedroom side. So just a super quick overview when you walk in, we have this tapestry. This like living room was all here before me. So just like super quick overview because none of this is like mine slash it's a shared space. Um, and then I'll flip around to the hallway. And then this is like my little side of the apartment, if you will. So I have this chair from my last apartment that me and my roommate Kaylee at the time had thrifted, which I, I know it's so ugly, but this chair is like so nostalgic for me that I keep it. Um, and then the bathroom looks pretty much the same as any other bathroom I've had. Pretty basic. My London shower curtain I've always had. Really gross toilet. You know, iffy, everything else. So dope there. And then... And here I have my bedroom, which again, honestly, not a lot has changed, but I just wanted to do a quick like little overview of it because it's very cozy, even with like the backyard that leads to a frat house um, <laughs> and everything else. I don't know, I've just really loved living in these apartments. So I wanted just to have some sort of documentation of that. I don't know. And then you guys have definitely seen 
the side of my room and videos. This is like a little bit more cluttered than normal right now, but that's just like the end of the year. And then on the back of my door, I have my grad outfit, which is freaking wild. So that's humbling to look at every night. I'm pretty sure that these two are the only things that are new in my room this year. The plant on the left is from Target and then the little pot that it's in is from TJ Maxx. I think it's super cute. And then I rescued this one from our kitchen. It was dying, so I'm trying to bring it back to life. If you guys have any tips, please leave them down below. I really want these little guys to thrive. I'm like very emotionally invested in them for whatever reason. I'm getting ready to run out the door, but wanted to do a quick outfit of the night. Like I said, this necklace is from Erin Ruth Jewelry. You've definitely seen it before. Black body suit from Windsor that I've been loving recently. Jean skirt from Target and then black booties from ASOS. So like casual, but kind of cute, kind of nice. We're not sure if this is the vibe, but we're going with it. Got a blog. <laughs> Nope, I'm out <laughs> Super early Tuesday morning. I have my last ever college 8 a.m. today. So me and my friend Evan are gonna go get coffee beforehand to celebrate. If you follow me on Instagram, check out my 5.30 a.m. highlight to like understand why we're doing this. But we're about to head out, so I will see you guys at dunk. But my thing is, is that do I Leaving the comm school at 11 p.m. Cute. Just girly things. Good morning. It is Thursday. I can't even remember the last time I like sat down and actually talked to you guys. The last two days have literally just been me at Oak House from like 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. essentially with going to work sprinkled in there just like knocking out some of my finals. I turned in one of my really big ones last night and then I have two tomorrow and one on Monday. So we're in like almost the clear right now, but not quite. So I'm about to go to Oak House right now yet again, but I'm gonna meet up with my friend Sydney for coffee quickly before I have a group project. That's my plan for right now. I will catch up with you guys probably around two. I have a call for a portfolio review at once. So I'm really hoping that goes well. I'm like nervous, but super excited about that. So I will update you guys like whenever there's something interesting to talk about, I guess. Yeah, I'm excited. Oops, sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <Good day. laughs> to always remember this hellhole. It's like three o'clock now. I can't remember the last time I talked to you guys, but I had some group projects and then I came home and made lunch. I had a phone call and now I'm in downtown Burlington. I feel like weird saying exactly where I am, but since it's kind of like the last week of my life, not that this is like not public knowledge, 
that like I go to Elon and obviously downtown Burlington is like the surrounding area but I'm normally not super specific of where I am just for like privacy reasons but I need to re-photograph a menu redesign that I did for my portfolio that's due tomorrow and my professor recommended photographing it on the darker background because I did it on like a white light table which he's right I do need to do but I don't want the background to be too dark or have too much contrast because I still want it to kind of blend in with the aesthetic of my portfolio so there's a coffee shop a little bit behind me called blend and co which is honestly one of my favorite coffee shops it's a really great environment and all the breezes that work there is super nice a lot of Elon kids go and they have I believe they have light wood tables if I'm like remembering correctly I haven't been in probably like a year just because I always get coffee on campus or like don't necessarily have the time to drive the like 15 minutes here but doesn't really matter I'm like rambling unnecessary details I brought my camera with me and my portfolio pieces are in my trunk so I'm gonna get those and try to get some photographs quickly I'm hoping it won't take more than like 20 30 minutes so we'll see fingers crossed <laughs> That actually went a little bit better than I was expecting. The tables weren't as big as I had hoped they were, but I think with like some Photoshop work and just like using the clone tool, I can get what I need. I'm trying to look through the photos now. I've already set up the page of my portfolio, so I only need four specific images, and I'm probably took close to like 100, 150. So there has to be like those four that I need somewhere between this camera and my phone. But for now, I'm about to head back to campus. It's 3.30 now, so it's not too late. I think me and my friend are gonna go get Chipotle, which is nowhere near campus, and honestly kind of dumb considering I have two finals tomorrow and I wanna go out tonight. But I think that's just like the self-care that we need right now is, I think I want tacos. Yeah, so I think, I think, I think Chipotle is what's happening. It's actually like two weeks later now. I just want to quickly hop on and wrap up this video. I'm pretty sure the last clip you guys saw was like a Friday. I'd gone to class and then gone to like a cookout in Oak House and stuff like that. Just like some random clips of some of my last weeks at Elon. But like I said, it is a couple weeks later now. So I have graduated. I am done. This is my last college week in my life, which is absolutely crazy. I'm not 100% sure how YouTube fits in my post-grad life, but I'm about to move into an apartment in Washington, D.C. and start a new job and all of that like transition of life. So if you guys want videos on that, make sure to give like comments and suggestions down below of exactly what type of videos you'd like to see, whether that's like work outfit ideas or just like tips on finding a job, college stuff still maybe. I don't really know yet, um, but I would really love any feedback or anything like that. I also just posted a one second a day video from my entire senior year of college here at Elon and I got some really great feedback on that so I'll have that link down below as well along with all my social medias and all that kind of stuff. I think that that is everything. Thank you guys so much for always supporting me. It really means so so much to me especially during these like big transition periods um, and yeah I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.